And you see, God knows our hearts. You know, and everybody in my house says, God knows your heart. But sometimes your heart is not aligned up with your actions. So when I hear Amen. God knows my heart, yes, God does know our hearts, but is our actions aligned up with our heart? Amen. And then, and then like Jesus, we have to learn to, to sacrifice. You know, Praise that the becomes Lord. that discipline against that temptation and things that you may want to do. That's when you bear your cross. You bear your cross and just like anything else, you may have pains, but God will heal you. And that's the cross that you Amen. carry. Whatever the aches and pains and the heartaches, God will heal you. Amen. God will restore you. If you're going through depression, God will clear up your depression. If you're lonely, he will open Amen. up new relationships. Amen. If you have having financial problems, God will, but then he will increase your finances. But it's going through that process. That's that trial and that tribulation. It's like, how are you going to go through that process? Amen. Preach on. What am I going to do when I'm in that process? Because that is how God says if you make it through and you stand strong and you don't trust on your own understanding, but you lean, lean not on your own understanding, but you trust in God, that's when Amen. we add unto you and increase your process, increase your life, and prosper you. Those are the promises of God to prosper you. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Right up in here. Praise the Lord. Bible. Praise the Lord. Somebody lean. Amen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to tell you what the word is telling you, but y'all quiet up in here. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. But I do want to say before uh, I close, because it's late in the day, that, you know, like Joseph, if we do have people close to us, whether it be in our home, our job, or in our church home, that may see that favor of God on your life. Praise the Lord. And they may try to stop it, whether Praise it's that intentional Amen. interference, whether it's to discredit your name, Amen. whether it's to bring your character down, Amen. Praise whether the Lord. it's to tempt you to do something so that, that you can say that now you doubt yourself. It may be things Amen. that people close to you may do to bring down your self-esteem so you're not sure so that you don't walk Amen. in the that God has asked you to walk into. See, people will speak death over you and you don't even know they're speaking death. Amen. But that's why you have to encourage yourself. Amen. But like Joseph, use him. Does anybody in here know what Joseph's name was or what it means? I, I, I just want to know, do anybody know what Joseph's name means? I think it means chosen one. It means to increase, to add unto. So he was already born with that favor of God on his life. Amen. He was already born knowing that he would have an increase. And just like you and just like me, children of God, God has plans to prosper us.